supplies the following muscles except so musculocutaneous nerve is an important topic and you have questions frequently on musculocutaneous nerve as mcqs so we should know some points about musculocutaneous nerve that it is a branch of lateral cord of brachial plexus remember that it's a branch of lateral cord now it supplies the muscles of anterior compartment of arm so if we see this image here the musculocutaneous nerve branch of lateral cord then it pierces this muscle which muscle is this this is the coracoid process this is the coracobrachialis muscle so it pierces coracobrachialis muscle as we can see here and it supplies the coracobrachialis muscle then it passes deep to the biceps brachii this is the biceps muscle it passes deep to that and supplies the biceps brachii it supplies the brachialis muscle which is deep to the biceps brachii and then it comes lateral to biceps brachii so basically it supplies coracobrachialis biceps brachii and brachialis which are the muscles of anterior compartment of arm and then here it continues down into the forearm as the lateral cutaneous nerve of forearm so lateral cutaneous nerve of forearm is a branch of musculocutaneous nerve so if i ask you musculocutaneous nerve is a motor nerve sensory nerve or a mixed nerve obviously it's a mixed nerve as the nerve as the name says it is musculocutaneous so it supplies the muscles that is a motor nerve cutaneous means it is sensory so muscles we have seen are the three muscles coracobrachialis biceps brachii and brachialis so it does not supply brachioradialis which is supplied by radial nerve so remember brachioradialis is supplied by radial nerve and cutaneous we saw is the lateral cutaneous nerve of forearm remember lateral cutaneous nerve it is a branch of lateral cord and it pierces coracobrachialis muscle so these are the important points about musculocutaneous nerve